satu pulau jadi makin bersih ya. Dan bila kita dapat jaga pengolah sampah ni, mungkin alam sekitar akan jadi lagi bersih. Kalau perlu duduk kampung, kalau benda berjaya, Alhamdulillah lah. Berkekalan ya. Jadi memang amat-amat kami berterima kasih lah. These are the beautiful Mersing Islands of Malaysia, where coastlines are being transformed from this to this. This is the community story of ending plastic litter. Malaysia is one of the most biologically diverse countries in the world. But like many developing countries, it has a plastic pollution problem, an issue that becomes worse on remote islands. In the Mersing Islands, there is no space for landfills, and there is no opportunity to recycle. So the local population launched a campaign to clean up their islands and establish a recycling program. So we did a household survey back in 2021 and found out that open burning was the most common practices by the island communities. Interestingly, from the same survey also, we found out that 80% of the island communities were not happy or satisfied with the current waste management practices and they called for long-term solutions to be formulated. The coordinating body on the seas of East Asia, COPSI, supports countries in the East Asian seas to reduce and prevent marine litter. COPSI has partnered with Reef Check Malaysia with funding from the United States Environmental Protection Agency to pilot community-based waste management in the Mersing Islands. The aim is to give local communities the opportunity to manage their own waste system and access recycling services on the mainland. The pilot implements a seven-step recycling program. Step 1. Education ReefCheck shares the benefits of recycling and reusing materials with local communities. Step 2. Separating waste Community members are empowered to sort their household waste into glass, plastic, and aluminum. Sorting bins are constructed and placed nearby. Households then deposit their recyclables into bins, ready for pickup. Step 3. Collection The waste is regularly collected and transported to a waste management center. Step 4. Compacting the plastic Compacting plastic makes it easier to store and transport, so a compacting machine was provided to the community. Step 5. Transportation The waste is transported by boat to the mainland. Step 6. Sale there, the waste is sold to a recycling center and the plastic loop is closed. Step 7. Sustainability The pilot showcases a viable business model that creates sustainable incentives for communities, tourism operators, and recyclers. The success of the Mersing Islands program relies on the cooperation of many stakeholders. Funding and technical assistance is provided by COPSI and US EPA. ReefCheck oversees the pilot on the ground and collaborates with state and municipal government agencies, community groups, and island tourism operators. The Mersing Island pilot builds on ReefCheck's existing recycling program in the nearby island of Tioman and demonstrates replicability of the model. Locals here have found the program has greatly improved waste management and benefited communities and tourism businesses. Pulau Tioman uh, kita sebagai penduduk Pulau Tioman haruslah mengambil tanggungjawab dalam memastikan Tioman bersih dan kita haruslah menyokong setiap usaha yang dilakukan oleh kita haruslah uh, menyokong setiap usaha yang dijalankan di sini. Residents of the Mersing Islands are looking forward to achieving similar results. Memudahkan semua pengunjung uh, dan juga pihak pengusaha-pengusaha pelancongan serta penduduk kampung khususnya lah untuk orang apa kumpulkan barang-barang recycle uh, dan tak perlu lagi mana bersusah payah nak uruskan sampai ke pusat urusan recycle di tanah besar lah. Satu program yang buat ni bagus jugaklah satu asat cara kan untuk kita didik. Dan ini harap benda ni berterusan dan mendapat sokongan daripada semua. So now the island communities will not only have an improved recycling facilities but also equipped with better waste management equipment. Ultimately, this will lead to healthier marine environment and improve the quality of life of the island communities.